I'm in Houston and I'm gonna make some uh, Mexican corn dip. This is um, New Year's Eve, 2020 is almost over. <laughs> so for this recipe, um, we're gonna need some green onions and I'm gonna use about four, okay? And I'm just gonna use that many up. I'm not gonna use that. I like onions, but in moderation. And then you're gonna need a cup of sour cream, a cup of real mayonnaise, I like Hellman's, um, a can of Rotel, you can use the original, hot, whatever you want, we're doing original. Two cans of Mexicorn, and I'm just using Green Giant. Two cups of cheese. And so let's just go ahead and mix it all together. We're gonna, I'm gonna see if I can get Granny to stay up for, to watch the ball drop. We'll see if that happens. <laughs> she says it was her idea to begin with, but she don't like to. She's like the chickens. She goes to bed with the chickens. Yeah. That's the way Christopher is, my son, too. We've been in the, in the community room playing music. So, we've been practicing. Two cups of cheese. I might have should have got a bigger bowl. Make a wheel. Hang on just a second. I probably could have halved it, but maybe we're going to be like pigs tonight. Yeah, this is going to be a better bowl. Okay, and then our sour cream. We're kind of limited on utensils here, so I'm just going to measure this helmet into this. Yeah, this place is so nice. They've got pretty much everything, but there's a few things that might be lacking. Okay, that's good. Then we're just going to mix it all together. Rudy had an appointment today and they told her everything sure was looking good. So we're so thankful. Hopefully we can go home in the next month or so. Okay, if you've never had Mexican corn dip, you are going to love it. Now, I'm going to go, it doesn't, the recipe doesn't call for pepper, but I'm just going to go ahead and put a little bit of pepper in, just because I like pepper. So, you just do what you want to on that. And that's it. So simple. Now, it's probably better. I've only had it when it's kind of set for a little while, kind of blended, probably for at least a couple of hours. But I'm going to go ahead and try it right now. Mmm. It is so good. And I like to eat mine with Fritos. But you can eat it with anything. So good. And I don't know if I told you to drain, drain your um, Rotel and corn. And that's it. Isn't that easy? All right. We'll see y'all next time. Hopefully, if you like this video, you're a subscriber by now. We'll see y'all. Bye. Happy New Year.